Hello friends, uh, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to configure hardware switch or software switch on 40 gate firewall. Uh, by the way, the version that I'm working on now is the virtualized version and I'm running on two, um, 623. And I have two ports, port two and port three that I want to put in the software switch as a member of software switch. So let's get started. Click on create interface, type the name. Change the type to software switch, click on member. And I've selected port two and port three. Here you can have manual or DHCP. I'm going to show you first the manual configuration. And you can set the DHCP server scope. Okay, so whenever you connect any of your device to port two and port three, you will get the IP from this range. Um, more or less, you know, this is simulating the hardware switch. Okay, so you have two ports in software switch as a member of software switch. And let me show you how you can do via DHCP. Well, I have DHCP server connected to the port three. So probably this will get the IP from the DHCP server. And once you click on DHCP mode, you will not see the DHCP server configuration here because any of the device that will be connected to port two will get the IP from the DHCP server. I like the way this interface is getting the IP. So click on okay. Let's wait for some time. You can see here, I'm getting the IP 192.168.254.141. And in similar way, you can connect your device to port two or any other members that you will define here so that this member gets the IP from the DHCP server. And let me show you how you can remove this or how you can manage the software switch from your CLI. So in order to do that, you will have to navigate to system switch show. So you can see here our switch configuration. Let's say I want to remove port three from my configuration. So how to do that? Well, you'll have to do unselect member port three. That's it, you're done. Let me check that in GUI. So you can see here, there is no port three here. And let's say you want to delete the switching configuration. So how to do that via CLI? Because in GUI, I don't see that option. If I remove this, it is asking me to have at least one interface defined here and which is a problem when you start, you know, removing the configuration. So let's see how we can do it via CLI. Before that, you will have to check whether there was any address book created for this particular switch 01. So you can see there was an address book created for this particular IP. Now you can see there is only one occurrence of switch 01 configuration, which is our software switch. Now you can go ahead and remove the configuration. In fact, you can do it from the GUI as well, provided you remove the address and all other reference of this particular switch 01. So that was the reason why it was not showing up. 
there. So let me show you that. If you click here, you, now you can see that there is a delete button. So I'm going to show you from the CLI. I'm going to delete the switch configuration. So now it is removed. All right, so right now the port two and port three is configured as the normal ports on 40 gate firewall. So that's all in this video, guys. Uh, please do subscribe to my channel, uh, hit the like button, and once again, stay safe, stay tuned. Bye bye.